Yeah, it's been great to have the opportunity to do two World Cups in Korea. I've never been to the country before, so it's pretty epic to see two different parts of the country and also have the opportunity to do two like, high standard races. Um, traveling has been pretty hard this year, so to have the chance to do two kind of in one trip is like really great as well. I raced here in uh, 2018 and in 2019, and uh, I love this place because it's like uh, there is a lot of uh, highlands and uh, it's very nice. Um, and uh, I think it's like, um, um, an Asiatic place so yes I like uh, to race here. So we've had the week here in Tongyong um, a lot of um, rest and recovering from the race last weekend and also just kind of trying to freshen up for the race this weekend as well um, getting to see a bit of the island when we can during our training slots so yeah just kind of taking it all in um, freshening up and yeah getting ready to race again this Saturday. We have uh, a lot of uh, trainings outside and uh, in our day it wasn't possible so it's um, very nice to to be uh, on the bike uh, outside and uh, to be together, so it's very nice. Yeah, the medal last week was like, a bit of a shock to me. Um, I've had a pretty hard season, um, just kind of struggled to kind of get going again after I had quite a long period off racing um, with COVID and injury. Um, so yeah, I really surprised myself and I was so happy to get on the podium again. Um, after a long time so yeah I'm excited for this weekend and yeah we'll just see what happens I guess. I would like to be on the podium again um, and it's my last race uh, of the season so um, I would like to, to do a good one but uh, we will see. I mean it's a very different course here in Tongyong so um, I think it will change the race dynamic a bit but I, it doesn't really change the game plan um, I want to get out hard and um, yeah and just see um, where I can get on the bike um, I think the bike is gonna really split the field up tomorrow because um, it's a pretty hilly course so yeah and then there's a bit of a killer hill on the run as well so that should be interesting um, every race I've done this year has been pretty flat so yeah I guess um, it'll change the dynamics a bit but I'm excited to do it. On the bike it's like uh, pretty difficult because uh, we will have uh, a lot of hills and it's the same uh, on the run so I can uh, remember uh, in 2019 and in 2018 uh, on the run it was so difficult because uh, when you're tired and you have to to, to run a hill a few times uh, but um, we love to race here because it's very nice and uh, it's um, it's not the same as uh, many races. Yeah it's kind of interesting looking at the start list because obviously we all race each other last weekend minus a few and plus a few extra athletes um, so it does kind of change um, the way you approach a race because we're all kind of used to each other now and like we've done a race with each other so we kind of know what each other's strengths and weaknesses are so I do feel like that changes the race dynamics a bit but yeah I just have to make sure I stick to my own plan and play the race to my strengths as well. Last year uh, I was like uh, we were like uh, two or three French athletes and now it's uh, different so um, it's nice to discover uh, South Korea together and uh, we laugh a lot. I mean Paris is only a few years away now and um, I kind of said to my coach at the start of this year I just wanted to race like that's all I want to do I didn't have any kind of performances in mind I just wanted to get some race experience because I feel like that's what I've definitely missed out on in the last two years um, so yeah I do feel like I've acquired that and I can take that into next year and really start to kind of um, shine through I guess um, there's a lot of British girls and it's very competitive so yeah I really want to start kind of putting my name on the map and I feel like I'm starting to do that so yeah I'm happy with how this year has gone. Because of Covid uh, we lose like uh, one year so the, um, the Olympics will be in just uh, three years so it will be fast uh, so the motivation, I think uh, the motivation is high for everyone and uh, um, I, I'm very uh, happy um, of uh, having uh, Olympics in Paris, in, uh, in France, so I think uh, we will have a good uh, show. Yeah, I'm really excited to race. I said to my coaches after so, such a long time off, I was just um, struggling to understand kind of 
what my purpose was in the sport because I'd had so long off of racing. So um, that's why I kind of turned around to my coach last, this year and said, I just want to race. I love racing. That's all I want to do. So yeah, I'm so excited to kind of be racing and racing and racing <laughs> for the last few months and yeah I'm excited to go again tomorrow. I'm very excited to race here because it's uh, my last race of the season and uh, yes we will see I hope to be on the podium but uh, I I had a good training this uh, week but I feel like a little bit tired like everyone because of Covid, uh, quarantine etc. It's complicated but uh, we will have a lot of fun here.